This video will give you a basic understanding of Drupal terminology. In Drupal, pages are called nodes, and when you hear the word node, or if you see any uh, reference in the administration features to node, that means any page in, uh, in Drupal. Now, another big term in Drupal is blocks, and the way um, Drupal, uh, pretty much like a building block in a house, you'll have the left side blocks. Uh, the top block which is like the header and you have the right side um, block also the footer is considered another um, <coughs> another block the bottom block uh, there is also the content bottom which is this portion right here and then the content top uh, so whenever you hear blocks it's just pretty much the different regions and as far as menu goes when you refer to um, left side this is the left side bar and that's the right side bar and then for the BYU template we have the content um, portion right here, the content block. This is where you'd be able to place uh, contact information for your department. As far as um, the menu management, um, administration management goes, uh, pretty much anything to do with content is up on under content management. Uh, this is where under content you'd be able to li find a listing of all the content that you have on your website. And this is where you create content types and this is where you create content um, and then there's other image and other advanced uh, features for content management. Uh, referring back to blocks and menus, uh, this is where you actually manage blocks. For example, if we were to go to blocks here, this is where you would decide where, um, for example, this menu for certification, you can specify if you want it to go to the right sidebar or the content top bottom or footer. Um, you could also just uh, drag and drop uh, where you want the specific menu to be um, and then right here whenever you create a new block it's not automatically placed at a, at a, a right or a left or content bottom you'll have to uh, specify here under the disabled menu where you want the new block to go to so uh, blocks are really good when it comes to um, inserting code or having a special feature on your on your website uh, somewhere maybe uh, where you want people to, to see it on the right or on the left. Um, the next is site configuration. Uh, this is where you would actually come and control the different modules or applications in Drupal and be able to uh, specify the different settings and um, there is also user management where you would uh, grant users permissions to your website and also be able to um, see who has logged in and activity as far as user goes. This is also where you would create different roles as far as uh, for example if I wanted to create a role for a basic user and grant them um, limited permissions to the website I'd be able to do it here and then here you have status report. Uh, status report is very key in that it gives you um, kind of like an assessment, the health assessment of how your Drupal page is going and um, of course there's the logout so this is pretty much um, just basic terminology and um, a definition of uh, what this menu up here does as far as administering the Drupal site.